So, Mr. Collins, can you tell me a little bit about the skyline you have here um, and what purpose that is? You're talking about the skyline? Yes. Yes. Well, the skyline is, is about four feet wide and runs the uh, 90 feet long, the entire length of the house. The idea was that there would be as much natural light in the middle of the house as around the perimeter. Okay. And it's accomplished that effect. Uh, the changing light patterns over the course of the day are something that uh, you're as much aware of in the middle of the house as you are at the perimeter. Okay. So with that feature, it seems like you've also put throughout the house and in every room, um, there appears to be roughly 18 inches of transom light, glass, clear glass. Uh, how does that work? Yeah. How does the skyline work with that? Well, the, the transom strip, which is the same depth as the structural beams mm -hmm. that support the roof, um, separates the, the walls of the house from the ceiling in, uh, in, not in every area, but in most areas of the house. So that the ceiling, the roof structure appears to float free and it is continuous throughout and you're, you are, wherever you stand in the house, you're aware of the ceiling floating free and okay. expanding the space that you're in. So that's what gives the house that open, airy, flowing feeling is that you've got this naturalness going throughout. That's right. That's what we were trying to achieve. Okay. And I think we uh, largely succeeded, at least I hope so.